It's probably the most sought-after invitation since Noah chose his animals for the ark. But this being a royal event, they don't just send you one of these, they call you first. I got phoned up two weeks before and uh, they said, John, Kate would like to invite you to a wedding, would you like to go? I said, oh, what date is it, because I'm not sure what I'm doing that day. <laughs> John runs Kate's local pub. A few lucky locals have received the call, the postman, the family butcher. We're very, very excited. Every, each day gets closer, we're getting more and more excited. The couple who run the convenience store, 13 years from immigrant to royal wedding guest. Appreciate us. <laughs> Land of opportunity. Absolutely, absolutely, yeah. This is supposed to be the not the Charles and Diana wedding, when the bride's family were allowed only 30 guests. William and Kate, were told, have been trying to keep a personal grip on their own day and have invited more than 70 friends and a clump of celebrities, including Elton John and soccer star David and Posh Spice Victoria Beckham. Like his mother, William has championed charities and the couple have made room for a woman named Shozna who William met when she was homeless. And for Lance Corporal Martin Compton, a soldier who was terribly wounded in Afghanistan. But inevitably, a royal wedding must have foreign royals, and 46 were invited, but one won't show up. Bahrain's Crown Prince Khalifa is too busy suppressing an uprising at home. But King Mizwati III of Swaziland will attend. He knows about marriage, having 14 wives. There are only 1,900 places in the Abbey. Choices have to be made, sometimes curious choices. Tony Blair and Gordon Brown, two former prime ministers from the Labour Party, lukewarm to royalty, have not been invited. But two former Conservative prime ministers, John Major and Margaret Thatcher, have been. Sarah Ferguson, the disgraced former wife of William's uncle, Prince Andrew, is off the list. But Kate's three times divorced black sheep uncle, Gary Goldsmith, is on, with a warning. I understand anyway that that particular um, uncle is going to be invited and I'm sure he'll behave extremely well and appropriately on the day. Or he'll hear from his favourite niece, the one who's about to become a future queen. Mark Phillips, CBS News, London.